Hey, welcome back. <clears throat> Let's see what we can get into uh, today. Got quite a bit of stuff going on today. Got to start mowing. We had rain last week, so as you can tell, had a little bit of grass growth. Need to stay ahead of it and knock some of it down. But uh, first off, I got to fix the mower. No, not going to fix the mower with that thing. Uh, take advantage of the nice, still, dewy morning and light the burn barrel off. Uh, if you could, keep an eyeball on that for me. Make sure it doesn't set the whole uh, property on fire. Cool, thanks. Well, what happened with the gang mower is on the PTO shaft, the pin had broken on this, and the original owners had put a bolt through. Uh, the hole in order to keep the uh, coupler onto the PTO shaft. However, last time I mowed, I sprayed a little bit of WD-40 on that just to keep it glued up, and uh, this disengaged from the PTO shaft. So I got to put a new pin kit into that PTO, uh, into that universal there, and uh, then that'll fix the mower and have that ready for uh, mowing. So, hold on a second. The uh, pin repair kit, hopefully I got the right one, consists of a new uh, pin, a spring, and a little washer. All right, the tricky part of this is you got the pin that goes in all the way through, so you have the button to push to disconnect. Spring goes in to hold tension on it, and then this little washer goes on top compressing the spring and then you got to peen over a little bit of metal to hold the washer in. My trouble always comes with this is that I don't have a clamp to hold that down while I peen it over. So once again, got to do the best you can with what you have. Well, I got the uh, mowing kind of done. I'm not doing the whole thing today. I'm just uh, kind of cutting out the trees in one area and uh, cleaning up the front so it looks presentable. But now it's off to the next task for today. One of the things I want to do is know the exact GPS location of each of these trees. Why do I want to know the exact GPS location for each of these trees? Well, that's something I'm working on and, uh, well, Hopefully in a couple of videos, I'll be able to show you. But uh, to do that, I need to go out and find the GPS location. So with that, I built a, uh, a surveyor. First, it consists of a GPS antenna on a metal plate on a pole that I can hold out and put next to trees. Then I have a battery operated little device here. This has a little Arduino in it that reads the GPS position off of a GPS chip. And then when I push the button, puts the position onto an SD card. So hopefully at the end of this, I'll have an entire uh, file full of the exact GPS locations. All right, first off, connect the antenna cable to it. And plug in the battery. We are good to go. And in a few moments, it will figure out its position. All right, the in trip server is up and running. And we should see the correction start to come down. That's the lower right hand number that says 1389, that's millimeters off. 
and hopefully in a little bit it will figure out where it is and start doing corrections. And my uh, little surveyor worked perfectly. If you're curious, it was an Arduino Mega controlling an F9P uh, U-Blox uh, GPS satellite chip, which then recorded all that data onto an SD card. And it did get accuracy down to the centimeter level. So here's an overview of all the data I collected on tree locations. You can see it makes a very nice grid, nicely uh, surveyed in tree locations. Alrighty, thanks for stopping by. Uh, please do subscribe, and uh, I try to put out a video every week, so see you next week.